Okay, so yeah, this is faster than light. Um, pretty popular game. Um, noted to be really hard, <laughs> for and for good reason. But yeah, one. I guess we'll just see how far we can get here. Um. Actually, did I? Come on. Oh yeah, that's what it was telling me. All right, okay. Um, I just want to plan out your route, the most efficient, the most efficient route, because you want to explore as many waypoints as you can to stock up on supplies. You don't want to be caught out in the in the cold in the late game with like. A severely underpowered ship. One, two, four, five, six. I think that we can go that way and then maybe come down here. Because we want to go through the nebula to throw off the, uh... The rebel pursuers. Oh yeah, what's the plot of this game? That's right, um... Yeah, a group of rebels are rebelling against the Federation. And that's not cool. And they're, they're trying to kill the Federation guys. Who are us, so that's not good. Um... Ah, shit. Well, now my ship's on fire. Um... I think we can go ahead and... We'll open the blast doors to them, but... Whoops. Let all the oxygen out. That should do it. Fucking... I really should start off by attacking their... Well, things are not off to a good start for our team. Um, I can tell you that right now. Um, <laughs> well, in fact, we've already lost someone. Alright, so, just gonna restart here and pretend like that didn't happen. Yeah. So. <laughs> it's a difficult game. The first seems to be a simple, simple nebula is actually filled with a good amount of debris from a brutal exchange between several ships. Wreckage drifts by your screens and tumbles into the depths of the nebula to be lost to sight. It's hard to determine who the commands were without, without closer investigation. Let's investigate the battlefield. Oh. There seems to be an enemy ship still on the battlefield. That's okay. We've got guns. Damn it. <sighs> yeah, he just... Just took out my weapon battery. And there go my shields. Fuck. Come on! Alright. Well, shields can stay, stay there for now. We're not in any immediate danger. Breach is confined to that room. It's always very satisfying just seeing the enemy ship just blow apart. Alright. Gonna have to have the. We can go fix that breach. Let me get the shields back up.
healing. And then everyone returned to positions. No. What are you doing in the outer room? I said go back to engineering. You want to stand around and huff oxygen, you do that on your own time. I've made a rebel scale and was positioned with the nebula to one of the passing. Howling up the FTL drivers. Well, why don't we stop him before he can get away and warn the enemy fleet? More specifically, why don't we just target its engines with all the firepower we can muster? Damn it! There's our O2. Hey, you want to put out that fire? And then you want to get the O2 back online before we all suffocate. It'll be good. All right. Um, I guess you should go to medical and get healed. You should head over and repair our sensors, even though they're not doing us any good within the nebula right now. Oh, this is, um, this is faster th than light. Um. We, uh. You command a ship traveling faster than light, um, and you have to get the plans for the, um, the secret rebel weapon to, to the Federation. And the rebels are chasing you down, trying to kill you, so that's not good. And the plasma storm knocked out most of my system. It's great. I hate this. Well, crap, if I turn off... There. Oh shit, my O2's offline, even. Crap, okay, I've only got four power bars to commit to system functions. Obviously, I need the life support online. It doesn't matter if the shields are up, if everyone's suffocating. Just make sure those guns stay down and make sure they can't retaliate. As long as their weapons are functional, then we don't have to worry about having our shields up. ship appears to be powering up its FDL. It's trying to escape. This ship is surprisingly well equipped. Please take this and let us live. Well, hmm. I could kill them just to be a dick, but, you know, they are offering up quite a bit of fuel. Alright. Power back on in engineering. And this attack ship ducking between the clouds and swirling space. Oh, swirling space stuff. It's hunting you. Try and get the jump move into attack. Shield systems online. All weapon systems functional. Let's take this guy down. And there go our shields. Damn it. I guess I better just blow, blow him up before this gets any worse. There we go. Alright, head over to repair the shields.
There we go. Um, so you should get over to medical. And then everyone should return to their positions. And now I should probably go heal all my crew members first. Why aren't they healing? Oh, right, because we don't have enough any power stocked in medical. Yeah. Alright, get back there. You're a gunner, I think? Yeah, you're a gunner. Get back to weapons. And you get back to engineering. Advanced Rebel Automated Chip ran station near a small Rebel space station. How about functioning sensors? It's impossible to tell what's inside. I hate these little droids that fly around. You just take down your shields. Dang it! Alright, get the droid command offline or else we're just gonna keep getting shot. And our oxygen's offline too. I gotta keep an eye on that. And you're dead. Thank you. Station is a storage site for military-grade weapons. Ooh, I like military-grade weapons. We've got a fire beam now. Ah, she needs critical. Yes, I know. Get over there and fix them. Alright, let me think. What would be the most efficient use of my... Upgrade points. Better shields would probably be effective. Yeah, I think we'll go for the level two shields. Then we got to get those blast doors functioning because we're gonna get start getting boarded by enemies at a certain point. And uh, having those really helps. Ugh, finally out of that nebula. For a small fee, we'll let you continue on your way. Reject their offer. Pirates, huh? Space pirates. I want those weapon shields systems down before they can do any damage to us. Alright. Alright, take the shields down. We will not accept surrender. Ha. You know, that would have been way more badass if I didn't have to, like, wait for the... the, the lasers to finish charging. If I, if I had said that and then, like, immediately fired on them, but, you know. What can you do? Alright, cool. So now I've got two shields. Stumble across the forward scout of the rebel fleet. Grr. Alright, so we gotta take out... Well, we've taken out their piloting system, so they're not going anywhere. I'm almost on missiles, though. I have to rely exclusively on the laser. Weapon systems are down. Hmm. 
And they're dead. Thanks for flying. Mercenaries are swarming the galaxy. No one got the less than legal services are in demand during this period of one rise one service. If I fight him, I can get supplies from him. It's always a good idea to target their weapon systems first. Obviously. Then they can't do damage to you until they get them repaired, and then they will do damage to you. But, you know, every little bit helps. I want to say I probably stand a better chance of getting scrap if I just blow the ship up. Damn it. There we go. Yeah, I get 17 scrap out of that as opposed to the 9 I would have gotten had I uh, taken them up on their offer. So because I'm greedy, I chose to blow that ship up and kill everyone on board. That seems logical. Damn it. And the O2 is offline. Again. Go fix that for us, would you? Take those weapon systems down. Come on. There we go. Ship breaks apart and you quickly salvage what you can. Out of post hails you after the scout was destroyed. Thanks for the help. We've been harassed nonstop by the scout. Take this on the house. Cool. Should upgrade those blast doors. And then... What should I upgrade next? The engines? Should I just save what scrap I have? Yeah, I'll just save it and then see what comes up. I might need it to repair. No, I'm definitely gonna need it to repair. My hull's already like less than 50% health. Next sector. Alright, well, if we go this way, um. We'll have to go proceed through to at least a hostile sector, at least two hostile sectors, and possibly Nebula. If we go this way, we're going to have to end up going through like three or four hostile sectors. So yeah, top route it is. Ooh, a distress signal. Distress signal is coming from a small space station orbiting an uninhabited planet. The satellite defense system has gone haywire and the repair crew can't approach without being fired upon. They're looking for help to fix or disable it. Yeah, let's just fire on the defense system. Why not? You fire a few volleys, but aren't able to penetrate the defense system. Shields, its weapons, no trouble piercing yours, though, when you take minor damage. Yeah, that's that's great. I knew I shouldn't have done that. I and mean, sometimes it works. Not that time, though. 